Hello and welcome to Daytime. We are here with George Tate, our computer whiz, and he's here talking today about viruses. Yeah, it's such a deep subject and we have such a little time, so we're just going to go quickly. Do it. Well, I'm going to break it down over the weeks that I come in. And today we're going to just talk about your services, your Microsoft services. This is where the virus and the spyware loves to come in. Mm. Be careful in here. We've created a system restore, so if you do happen to to hurt the machine, you can just go back to that time. But try to do some research before you do things. I, if you go to the start, and we go up to the run, and we talked about the MS config. You see MS config, M-S-C-O-N-F-I-G. That stands for Microsoft Configuration Utility. This is where we configure things that start up in the computer. So if we say OK on that, and let's go in there and take a look. Now we were there once before, and we were looking at what was in our startup. And hopefully everybody's turned off everything you don't need. At the top, you'll see this where it says services. Service. These are things that ru are running in the back of your computer without your knowledge. Huh. Okay? They, some of them are absolutely necessary. A lot of them are you don't need them. You should go in there one at a time, ask Google, what is this in my startup? What is wow. this in my service? And if they say, oh, that's for when you have text messaging on your phone, and you don't have text messaging on your phone. What's the point? What's the point? Now, a good way to, to just wipe these out quickly is hide all Microsoft services. We realize it's a Microsoft operating ah. system. We need it. We're going to hide that. Now, when we hide the Microsoft operating system, we see that Office Source Engine is on mine. On yours at home, you will have a ton. A, a ton. Yes. Turn them all off. They have nothing to do with the operating system. Leave on the antivirus. That's the only two things you really need, unless, of course, you're in a network. But we're talking about home users, just yeah. email and just regular. So once you do that, you say, okay. Clean it up. Yeah, you turn it off. You just unclick it. It'll ask you, do you want to restart? I'm not going to restart right now. We're going to get into a little bit more fun stuff with the computer. Viruses, to me, is like we talked about the Lord of the Rings in Gollum. We can follow Gollum down to the bottom of the pit, and, it, and it's so miserable down there, and people just are hurt by it. It's just a terrible subject. What I want to do is give away, we'll go to the doctor's bank, and we'll show you what the computer can do for good things. So if you call in and you tell me what was the wizard's name on the Lord of the Rings, we're going to give you this CD here. Whoa, it, I love it's giveaway. a soundtrack to a film. It's an in-home film that I made. Oh, and that CD large. made me 50 friends uh, from Aww. 18 bands from around the world just through the internet. I've never met them personally. Cool. But they let me use their music. And once I made that CD, Montreal got a hold of me. And then I started to be the announcer for the Montreal International Reggae Festival. And I got to Excellent. meet Maxi Priest and Cool. So how, how, what caller do you want? Um, uh, any caller that calls in and says... How about we have the third caller today? If you're the third caller, you get to win... Destination Jamaica. Jamaica, which is a soundtrack to a film. It's a beautiful music, really relaxing. Lovely. And um, that'll get the, get used to calling into the show because it's a call-in show. And Excellent. George, thanks so much for being here today. You're going to be back next Wednesday, as usual, to talk more about computers. Thanks again. And daytime viewers, we will be right back. Stay tuned.